Yo, what's up, everybody? I'm about to do a skip for y'all. I hope y'all like it. Do me a favor. If you want this more and more, hit that like button down below. Hit that subscribe button down below for more content like this. I thought I was pointing in the right direction. I wasn't. And uh, let's get this get started. Shit. Let's see. So it says here that you were booked for a marketing fee. Am I am I saying this right? Does does this sound okay to you that you do these type of things to our country? I mean, can't you think of another approach? Can't you think of somewhere where you can go and get this dealt with? Something wrong with how things are ran here in America to you at all? Is it? I mean, I never said it was, you know, I just, I sometimes go through depression, Doc. I don't know what to do. There are certain times where I just want to, you know, end it all and, and, and give in to the demons within my head. It's just all so hard, Doc. I, I mean, look at you, you're a professional. You, you have a great opportunity here, a great career. And look at me, I'm a nobody loser. I can't do nothing right, Doc. I can't. I mean, I try and I try and I try medication and therapy and it just it doesn't get me anywhere, Doc. I mean, what do you think I should do? Well, do you want to hear the real truth of why you can't do certain things? See, to me, it seems like you're mentally blocked. You don't know where to go. So every morning you wake up, you're afraid. You're afraid of what people think of you. You're afraid of who you are on the inside. I mean, I could just be pulling thumbtacks out of a wall here when I say this, but do you really honestly believe that your depression is based on your mood? Or is, the, is, it, is it the people, excuse me, is it the people that you surround yourself around? Because quite frankly, I know a little something about that. And that, my friend, is depression. You suffer depression. Do you feel like you do? Or not? Honestly, Doc, I, I don't even know. Like, to me lately, it's like what I do think and what I do know never match up. It's just, it never seems to match up. I mean, I'm a good guy. I have a good heart. It's just certain days I want to be happy around the people that I love. And it's just, I'm mentally blocked and I can't focus right. And I'm just so depressed and angry and mad at the world. I mean, it's, it's, it's gotta be me. I mean, who else can it be? Like, I'm the only one that suffers this. Sometimes I just feel like I'm out of my mind. Like, I, like I don't know what to do. It's just, it's all crazy, Doc. Maybe you're right though. Maybe I do have a depression. But what, what do I do? I'm very scared. I'm very nervous. What do I do? <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. So what you're telling me here is that you're afraid. I can't. I cannot. You're telling me that you're afraid of somebody else judging you because you're depressed over something that's going on in your life, something that you cannot control, and something that esquires when you take the wrong medication. I just, I don't understand. 
Why don't you enlighten me on why you're so afraid of what people think and know of you? You may think it's funny, Doc, and I understand that. Maybe I need to laugh somewhere in life as well. But I have dreams too. And I'm so busy out here making other people's dreams come true. What about mine, Doc? What about mine? I try so hard every day to stay faithful and loyal and positive to everybody, but where does it get me? Stuck inside of a stuffy office room, talking to a therapist. Is this what really life, is this what life has really become? That I have to pour my heart out for $49.95 a month? But I could be out there having fun, Doc? You just don't get it. I don't think you ever will. I want to tell you something. And let me take my glasses off when I say this. I have been through a lot in my life. So much that you cannot even fathom. Yeah, I've grown up on roaches and rats and food stamps and Section A. But I'm still here, Doc. I know what I want in life. And this is not it. I have bigger dreams in life, Doc. Nobody knows that. And even when I tell people, nobody listens. No one. It's like I'm stuck in a room by myself. It's like, where is the love? Where is the respect, the mutual respect that I give to other people and they never get it back to me? Like, <sighs> I just don't know, Doc. I don't. I mean, I take five steps forward and when I do, I just take three steps back and I'm back in the same position I was in. Same. What do I do, Doc? What is it that I have to do to prove that I am loyal and faithful to everybody? To get rid of this depression, this demon snake inside my head, stealing all my lovely memories away, plastering it on the concrete ground. I just need help. really do. And if you can't help me, then what am I doing here, Doc? You tell me since you think everything is funny. What am I doing here, Doc? I mean... I have nothing left. <laughs> nothing. I know you're doing your job, and I'm just a moron. You're not a moron, son. We all go through certain things in our lives where we want to, you know, push forward and do better. But sometimes we make the wrong decisions. That's who you are. You're a guy who made the wrong decisions. That's all. And if you remember one thing that I say from this course, that thing is, whenever life knocks you down, you're in a perfect position to pray. Remember that. Because one day it will come in handy. Don't beat yourself up over people tearing you down or whatnot. People are going to do that. That's human nature. It's up to you to choose the right path in life. Because once the devil gets a hold of you, Oh, once the devil gets a hold of you, he will never let go.
He stole the show. And you let him. So what does that make you? It makes you a new fool. Why not make him a fool? Make him pay for putting through this. You're a great guy. You are a great guy. You have a great smile. And wherever you get in this world, you're going to hold that with you. Always think to yourself, I am the best version of myself that I can be throughout the day and that's all that matters. I'm not here to judge you, son. That's not my place, too. My place is to let you know that you are headed down a road that is going to take you nowhere. This is the time to change. This is the time to motivate yourself. This is the time to keep pushing. This is the time to stay grinding. Because without those training wheels on your bike, you will fall if you do not know how to ride it. Life's motto is you gotta crawl before you walk. We don't become positive over time. Or excuse me, overnight. And I think you know that, right? So, just know, whenever you're depressed, or you're having a bad time, there's always outreach to every problem. For nothing is as bad as it seems. Look up. Hold your crown. You remain the king.